hello guys welcome to being engineers in this tutorial i will tell you how to measure ac voltage by using a multimeter i am using mastic mas h30l i did the unboxing and the first impression in the previous video i will give a link in the description check it out if you want now to measure ac voltage with a multimeter b very very careful so first unwrap the probes take a note of the processes i will be telling one by one to measure ac voltage first of all put the rotary switch to this range this v and this ac sign will denote that this portion is for ac voltage measurement put this rotary switch at the highest reading that is 600 volt ac this is was the first step the second step is put the common probe to the common terminal done the third step is very important put this positive probe or the red probe to this you can see the v oh milliampere it is written here put the red probe here don't put the red probe at 10 adc that is unfused if you put this probe here and check the reading your means will be short and it will be a disaster for the appliances so let's put this in the V ohm milliampere terminal done the next part is connect this probe tips to the next part is connect the probe tips to the AC main so this is the ground part this is the live wires I'll as for the AC the polarity doesn't matter I will put this black hair black probe here and put this red probe here don't touch the tips it is giving a reading of 226 volt AC 226 volt AC it's okay now if you want to keep that reading press hold the reading will be fixed remove the probes carefully from the socket so that's how you can take the reading of ac voltage by a multimeter so this is showing 226 volt ac now if you want to remove the probes from the multimeter do the reverse in the first process we did the common terminal first then put the red terminal in this process at the time of taking out the probes first take out the red probe then take out the ground probe so that's how you can take AC voltage reading from a multimeter and please take care about what you are doing and follow the steps carefully otherwise it would make some damage so that's it in this video in the next video i will show you how to check a capacitor if it is in working condition or not till then stay tuned to our facebook page being engineers for latest updates and like this video if you have learned something new subscribe to our channel being engineers we will meet you in the next tutorial till then bye take care yeah. Oh, 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 oh,